Hello, Leo. This is your bonus reading. I hope you don't mind my brand new snazzy board I made up. It's fucking awesome. It really is. Anyway, we're ready to go ahead and do your bonus reading. It's going to be duality, so we'll just look at you and the person you're dealing with right now. Let's see. Look at this. Walking away for a new cup and like deciding to sever things and let it die. Hmm. Leon, what the fuck? Let's see. It is your season. Happy birthday, guys. Don't go crazy. Right, right. Still kind of working on it. Like, I need to shave down the edges right here because of how I made it. Because it was made with a uh, couple document frames. So, and I already have like some of my old candle wax on it. So, I gotta clean that again. But other than that, it's not too terribly bad. Anyway. Let us see. Yeah, so the first paragraph for you. On this side, this is supposed to be you. And then this person you're dealing with. And then what's going on down the center, right? Um, you might be trying to get away from some games you had to play. shit from the past when it comes to the lovers uh, so we're running with impulse did that thing stop again? yeah it did I don't know why it's doing that hmm give me like two seconds I'll turn the music on Oh uh, my goodness. Okay, let me see. Okay, I just set it back like four hours. It'll catch up eventually. Okay, so. Leo, so far for you guys right now, you are... There were some head games in the past, or you had to outwit some people back in the day. <coughs> oh, excuse me. <coughs> yeah, one more time. Okay. Anyway. Hopefully that's it. But yeah, there was like some games you had to play with somebody you were very much connected to in the past, in the love situation side, right? You might have ran away impulsively, but you were still thinking about, um what you were going to do while you were waiting during that time, like there was a lot of stuff put into it with the three of wands and you are feeling left out in the cold, or at least these people are when it comes to dealing with you, but you're keeping a close full watchful eye out and here's Capricorn's card, of course we also have you with an Aries Leo and Sag, you might be trying to escape from this devil or this devil's trying to sneak back in on you, one of the two right, so your person of interest They got okay, so something they tried to do didn't work too well. I feel like they gotta try to stand up to that devil over here. They might be escaping their own little uh, mental traps, or they were watching you try to escape from them because we have the five of swords here again. They're just standing all proud and pretty while someone's just running away. Now they just want to go somewhere. Or probably argue or something. I don't know. Like, they're going. They're heading somewhere. Trying to fight a battle or fight something that really isn't going to bring any true beginning of joy or something. Like they talk a good game but they really can't like but when they go to put up the fight it doesn't work out for them. And they do want to communicate with you. It could be an air sign you're dealing with especially with this Aquarius card. And we also have you up here, Leo, as well. And, you know, they might keep their emotion to themselves in the dark, but still look cool. Um, could be a Cancer. Pisces. Scorpio. Two 
20 seconds. All right, Leo. So these four came out. Not releasing something that's keeping you in anxiety and not trying to go towards this tower. Like you're just shouting at it to keep it from like having to have it happen. It's like Frus Rona. Like <laughs> like Skyrim and shit. Like you're just like, nah, man. Nah. Okay. Sorry about that, my husband had to water the plants. I hope you heard me during this round, but if not, like, I'll repeat myself here in a second. He's taking care of the garden, so. Alright, so first card we got, like, you do want to reveal some secrets, but when it comes to whatever it is with this person, but you still have your back turned with the High Priestess, you might be ignoring your intuition as well. Um, oh, yeah, because you're bothered. You're, you're very much bothered about what's will come in the future um because you feel because you, you feel like this person's completely unfair to you like they don't give you the respect on it like you deserve right that's understandable um now they might now you want to take your cup somewhere else maybe to the past here's the queen of cups maybe you feel like you're the, this person's counterpart since the king's over here wanting to offer something or maybe you figure they're going to want to offer you a cup in order to convince you oh well, i'm not that unfair but there you are queen of wands just standing all pretty just being like nah uh foos rona dude foos rona Here's that air sign again, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. They might want, you might think they want to come for some truths from you. Maybe that's why you're scared they're going to butter you up. When it comes to some sort of lack of commitment. One, two, three, four. Alright, one more. I always lose count, and I don't mean to. Let's see. You feel like this commitment leaves you a void, and if, if they come to you, it's just going to be like, or they're coming to you to tell you that, or that's what you're assuming they're going to do. Hmm. It's very interesting. It's like, you, you're you kind of aware that, like, they're kind of unfair with their practices and what they give you, but they do give you love, so you do recognize that, but you're not entirely sure if that love is, um, true i will say all right so once again with this side right something isn't working for this person when it comes to like it having the courage to stand up to the devil and they probably see that as you since your cards here um they probably watched you walk away from the bullshit games they played and probably went running spread news talk about something go into battles or whatever try to fight for some shit but nothing came up sunny side up, to say the least. Came up sunny side down with that ace of wands. So it didn't start the way they thought it would. They do want to communicate because their emotions are in a bit of secret. Okay? Okay. So let's see. What's your next word? They got a pipe dream of sorts. Like they dream of finding that love once again. Hmm. Um... But they do recognize that they are, yeah, definitely air or you, Leo. Uh, you're right there. Here's this bird, and it's just kind of like, you know, let's agree to disagree. It's like they, as their back, as their back is turned, waiting patiently. They're recognizing that it's just two totally different people, or y'all are two totally different people. You know, like might have had a good relationship of sorts. Back in the day, but you know, someone had to do some sneaky sneaks 
here, which is what caused the cycle to really begin, and now it's like they don't know what the hell they're looking for. They don't want to wait on something that seems empty, and they just got too many Bettys, but they would still choose you over all the other Bettys, so... At least you know how they feel for you. I, I really feel like this person cares a lot about you. But the thing is, is like, it's the games. And it's like, I think you turned your back to their games. And that's why they're a bit frustrated and flustered about why you aren't coming back a little bit. So let's see what happens if you guys approach each other. This is going to drive me crazy because it's not centered on the actual thing. This is what I get for like one symmetry. Let's see. Well, this is the first card of the spell. Okay, so you are completely unadulteratedly unbothered by their presence. Like, you're making money, so that's good to know. Like, you're getting somewhere, you're comfortable, you're starting to figure things out. You actually are listening to your intuition, so, you know, good deal. It's like you guys are trying... It's almost like you guys have figured out how worthy you are just to have yourselves instead of worrying about what everybody else is worried about. Now you're looking at over here with all these options, right? You got all these options that you are glancing over, especially when it comes to surprise, surprise man. And nah, it could be Capricorn because you did have it over here, but this is like, hmm, maybe someone's gonna apologize for all that shit that they did. Maybe they realized their relationship doesn't wasn't healthy for them, so that's why they got away for a bit. But now it's like they want to come back in and apologize for causing all this heartbreak. So that could be you wanting to do that. Mind you, cross watchers, you can switch this shit around too. Like whichever one side you um, resonate with, good deal. You know, I just, fuck. I didn't even start with that intro, but that's okay because you know. But yeah, if it, it resonates with you, good deal. Not everything is meant to if it's not your story. So if it doesn't sound like part of your story, you don't have to take it. Yeah, you're like, I'm sorry. Kind of like, I'm sorry that, like, I fucked everything up. You know, it took me a while before I realized I was an asshole. It could be an air sign, or it could be you when it comes to recognizing a bad attitude or bad attributes or somebody, right? So what is the inevitable outcome? Um, you might still hold a grudge. <laughs> you might just be looking like, I want to boil their rabbit, Leo. <laughs> like, well, the Queen of Cups is also on your side too, so it's just kind of like, hmm. They might turn your back to you as well. You might still be pretty pissed about the head games, or they could be pissed about that with you. Either or, really, because this is like saying it could be both of you. And neither one of you could really know that about each other. Could be a mother figure, empress right here, Taurus, Libra, female Aries, depending. Bitter, mad, angry, wanting to say some words back to you. Okay, it's like this person with the Knight of Swords over here just took off to um say shit to everybody. But now that they like have contact with you, it's like they want to fight you. Even though it's like you're coming to have an actual discussion with them about what happened or why you were that bothered. Secrets coming out and like just completely unbothered just completely like shutting I feel like this person will shut you down before you ever let them or before they ever let you Talk right like before they even want to hear shit once again Pisces cancer Scorpio and they were over here as well as king of cups Um I was looking at you like you're a brat, and that's probably why you aren't wanting to take a leap of faith with this person right now. Oh. And you're very much inquiring as to this as well, apparently. Because that just came out of nowhere, you know. Trying to move forward, though. Cancer's card once again. So you probably are dealing with a water sign, an air sign. Um, 
not really anything about pentacles. So it's not really as much about money as it is about, like, the thoughts and feels going out, really. Like, I think there's only a couple pentacles, and even then it was like, no. We got fire, we got air, we got water. So whoever it is you're dealing with, or whoever's dealing with you, that's kind of the scenario you might be looking at in your bonus, right? So... That's your bonus, <laughs> Leo. Um, thanks for watching my video. If you want a personal reading, my email is down below. I, first reading's free on the house. Everything else is, you know, comes with a price, of course. Always accept tips and donations. And if you like this, please like, share, and subscribe if that's what you want to do. It's all up to you, really. Your choice. I will see you guys later. You take it easy. Bye-bye.